Ever wondered what corona is in the electrical world? No, not the virus but a phenomenon seen in high voltage power systems. Allow me to unravel the mystery for you. In the realm of electrical engineering, corona is a discharge phenomenon that takes place in systems operating at high voltages. Picture this. The air surrounding a conductor becomes ionized. This ionization is not a random event, but a direct consequence of the high voltage. As the air ions start to dance around the conductor, they create a luminous glow. Accompanying this glow is a distinct hissing noise, a telltale sign of corona in action. So, corona is far more than a term associated with a global health crisis. Indeed, it plays a vital role in the field of electrical engineering, influencing the design and operation of our power systems. That's right, corona is not just a term related to a pandemic, but it's also a significant phenomenon in the field of electrical engineering. Now that we know what corona is, let's dive into the causes of this phenomenon. Corona discharge, in essence, is primarily caused by the ionization of air near conductors, when the electric field strength surpasses a critical value. This means that when the electric field gets too strong, it can rip electrons off of air molecules, creating a glowing region of ionized air, or corona. But it doesn't stop there. The size and shape of the conductors can also influence corona discharge. Larger and sharper conductors can intensify the electric field and thus increase the chances of corona discharge. The condition of the conductor surface is another factor. A rough surface can create more points for the electric field to concentrate, leading to more corona. Lastly, environmental conditions such as the pressure and temperature of the air can also affect the occurrence of corona. So it's not just about high voltage, but other factors also play a role in the occurrence of corona discharge. Understanding the effects of corona discharge is essential. So, what happens when corona discharge occurs? Let's delve into it. First off, Corona discharge leads to a significant power loss due to the ionization of air. The high voltage causes the surrounding air to ionize, forming a conductive region around the conductor. This ionized air, or plasma, allows current to leak from the conductor into the atmosphere, resulting in a power loss that can be quite substantial in high voltage systems. Next, the process of corona discharge also leads to the production of ozone gas. This can be harmful in large amounts, causing damage to both the environment and human health. However, in controlled environments, it can be beneficial, such as in air purifiers where ozone is used to remove odors and kill bacteria. Corona discharge can also cause radio interference. The rapid changes in the electric field due to the discharge can produce electromagnetic waves which can interfere with radio communications. Moreover, the discharge can lead to damage to the conductor insulation. The continuous bombardment of the conductor by ions can cause the insulation to deteriorate over time. Lastly, corona discharge is often accompanied by a hissing noise. This noise is caused by the rapid ionization and deionization of the air around the conductor. The effects of corona discharge are not always negative, they can be beneficial in certain situations. So, it's not just about the challenges but also about leveraging these effects for our benefit. Wrapping up, Corona discharge is a fascinating yet complex phenomenon in the electrical world. It's a process where the air around a conductor becomes ionized and electrically conductive, causing the conductor to glow. This occurs when the electric field strength is high enough to ionize the air but not high enough to cause electrical breakdown or arcing to nearby objects. We've also discussed the causes of corona discharge. It can occur in high voltage systems particularly where sharp points, edges, or uneven surfaces are present on the conductor. It's also more likely to occur under wet or humid conditions and at higher altitudes where the air is thin. The effects of corona are multifaceted. On one hand, it can lead to power loss, radio interference, and damage to the conductors. On the other, it can be used beneficially in applications like ozone production, air purification, and even in some types of lighting. Understanding this phenomenon is crucial for electrical engineers. It helps them design and maintain electrical systems to avoid the negative effects of corona, while potentially harnessing its positive aspects. This knowledge is also key in ensuring the safety and efficiency of our electrical systems. Remember, corona isn't just a virus that's taken the world by storm, but it's also a significant phenomenon in the electrical world that engineers deal with every day. Thank you for watching. Stay curious, stay educated. If you like the content, please like and subscribe to our channel and don't forget to click on the bell icon to get new video updates.